Hello everyone, welcome back to my second episode of my Let's Play. And there has been a change, but you're thinking, well there's still a volcano here, but... Oh. So basically, <laughs> um, after doing some little bit of research after I finished my first video, the Minecraft version is a harder version. Um, basically, everything's harder to make, really. That's the reason why. Um, and the reason why I'm not keeping that is this Let's Play, uh, when I, like now on this, um, t uh, difficulty level, when I'm finished, I should be done around, uh, maybe level 100, I mean not level 100, um, oh, episode 100, maybe episode 20, 120, but like if I was on that, it'd be close to 200 and you want to s I don't want to spend this whole channel just on this one let's play. I know I could, but it'd be so much work. Yeah. Hold on. It'd be lots of work because it's hard to get materials. and You know, it'd be lots and lots of work. But basically, this is the exact same seed as the other world. It is um my YouTube channel name. Exactly how it is. Caps, letters, all that. Numbers. Basically, um, everything I built, but this chest, and this, 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 and this, and this. Um, I hope you guys don't get mad or anything, but I spawned this, all these ores in. I copied it exactly from the other world, so I didn't cheat, don't worry. But, now, since I know, like, I can get six diamonds from, uh, there's a cave there I went into, and a cave over there. Um, I cannot go into these two caves ever again, because then I can just double the amount of ore I have, which I, no, I'll have to start mining that direction way. But basically, I spawned in everything exactly, but stuff that's new is, the, the I kind of made the farm a little fancier. I have, this is corn, flax, I forget the name of that, wheat, potatoes, and carrots. I have a cactus farm for my waterproof pipes, which I think I have enough. Uh, my reeds. And a coke oven. Which I actually just put down, well you can see three, for the sterling engine I have up there. But basically today we have three things to do. We have finish the ores. So basically, well in this you can see, oops, the mas macerator is back to the way it was. The only downside is there is no more, um, um, industrial um, centrifuge and the solar panels are like this they're really simple to make that's just the normal one the low voltage one I need quite a bit of these to make one of those and from there and from there you know I won't be using too much solar panels but everything else is pretty much the same um, I'm happy that we have um, we have the linking books and all this stuff red power still in this everything in here so first off I think we should connect our pipes to these tanks I extended them from the other one it's just glass in a eight square in the crafty bench so you just fill it all up except the middle I made a couple more Hopefully this is enough pipes, but... Oh, and the other one is, um... other thing to do is just make some more machines. Like, we're gonna need an extractor, um, an electric furnace I'm gonna want, you know. That's the other basic, um... tools that are needed in Feed the Beast. So, um... And think um hope you guys are okay with the change I did. I hope it's not drastically at least it I didn't do it farther from now, but everything is this like don't think I cheated. You can go check. There might be one or two off just because I was just right clicking trying to get, you know, forty two, I hit forty three. I'm not redoing the whole thing just to get it, but uh, I did not cheat, so don't worry guys. <laughs> Usually I end up like, like when I just play normal single player, I'll be playing, I'll be like, I don't know, 
because let's see um, that way where my arrow's pointing is um like one of those orange rock biomes like if I was over there and I needed a redstone engine I'd just spawn one in um, oh I need more pipes I'd just spawn one in but I'm not doing that on this but I have lots of that I need glass oh darn it turn the sound a it's gonna be really quiet now I bet but that no that rains really loud but let's just cook some of that oh I don't peaceful for a minute I was in a creative bridge just fooling around so sorry about that um glass I'm gonna need cobblestone and yeah is it night time yet there we go what'd that say okay so qu I guess oh, equivalent exchange is a pre-release but I will not put that in to be honest the only time you will see equivalent exchange in these is if um it's actually in the game I'm not gonna just update it for that oh, I'm gonna need a little bit more I think Once this volcano runs out, I'm going to be getting my lava from the um, nether one-off. Damn it. Basically, I either do it how um, I would be using transposers from the red um, power mod and just kind of pipe them through to an ender chest type of thing, or I may be able to find a different way to do it. But I am not sure. Okay, so let's just do this quickly. Got some bees too. Which I'll be fooling around in the future. Um, and there's also a village that way. My ear is pointing. Desert that way. And volcano or whatever. But I don't plan on having my main base here. Um, I'll likely have it in that autumn. Or over there somewhere. Cause the time I'm done, this lava should be all used, and I can, I can move this stuff if I need to. Let's cook it again. Wait, no, never mind. It goes here. Let's hope this is enough. Please. Ta-da! Yes. Put those seeds on the ground. I don't need them. I got enough. But oh, stop raining. A while ago, I get. Sorry. Um. I'm gonna need. Actually, I think I'm good. Oops. No. So I only have one Sterling engine up there right now, which ain't gonna pump it out fast, but it'll it'll pump it basically. Now I'm pretty sure this goes down pretty deep. It's just a one wide source block. Or not really a source block, but each block's a source. So it goes down, I'm guessing, pretty deep. I hope so, otherwise I'm going to have to start going into the nether. Oops, come on. Which ain't that big of a deal. I'm going to need to go there eventually here anyways for glowstone. Because I need it to make advanced circuits and some other stuff. Okay. Here we go. Here comes the lava. Yes. Now, I will not cross the geothermal um, thing off until I have it hooked up to a bat box. Basically, we're going to let that pump and we are going to go get our macerator hooked up. And likely get an iron furnace going, or an electric furnace going too. You can see, like, this is the same seed, it looks the same, but you can see how it, like, float over here more this time. That's why I didn't build my house, like, over there. Okay, let's build that macerator. I'm gonna need that. That. Um. Did I not? 
Oh, shoot. Damn it, I gotta go get some flint. Um. Mm, shit. Um. I need three flint cobblestone. I'm pretty sure there's some, um, gravel this way. Um, I, on the other world, I could have, um, like the more Minecraft one. I could have just, um, used, um, like in the, what's it called, thermal expansion, pulverizer, and that furnace. But, um, you need to, like, they can't use, like, power off bat boxes. You can, you have an engine, you can hook up conductive pipes, or you can have, um, an energy holder thing. I forget the name of them. But you have one of those. And this cave here is one of the caves I cannot mine ores in. So basically, I was going to put a quarry over top of this at some point just to get all the marble, but I guess I will not be doing that. If I recall, there should be gravel in here. Yep. Just need three. One. This likely won't be too interesting, but... mind that or forget is there another yep we can't mind any of that to be honest I already have it so basically just pretend it's not there do you know what I think I'm gonna cut here out of way if I don't get the gravel Oh, it's all up to you. There we go. Three gravel. Now let's get back. It's a little bit of lag in here, but oh, those stupid cows! The noises are so annoying now. They just like puff out huge things of air, like they're snorting. That one mood. But, um, also, I don't know if this is true or not, but I was reading, um, I know some of the wikis are just, like, you can, anyone can go in there. I could go in there and go, well, if you know, if you put a, a piece of steak in the macerator, you get a cow. And, it, and I could put that in there and it would go in, but apparently these have a chance, you know, like, I don't put more of this stuff on the ground or something. But I think it's a really low chance here comes the lava really slowly I may put gold pipes in there actually speed it up okay just just unlocking my phone to see how much time I've used okay so how was it boom boom bam macerator Put that up right here. Now, on the electric furnace, how would I make that? An iron furnace, and this iron furnace is just, yep. That's what I thought. It's really quiet. Why is it? Hmm. I guess there's no animals or something. Usually I hear lots of noises, but. Um, oh, I got lost. Right. Um, I need five. I need one more iron. One. Oh, one. So, we got our first little bit of lava here. 
Now this will hold enough for now, but I'm not sure how much. There's quite a bit of lava in there, I'm guessing, because it's the tip of my little pentagon thing right there. Like it likely goes down deep. Um, this will be one of my main sources because it's. Uh, I would use solar panels, but like I said, they're they're actually kind of hard to make if you kind of think about it. But uh, I need redstone. Just take half a stack with me. Dank, dank, dank. Boom. Wait, what did I do wrong? All the way around. So what should I start doing? Let's do my copper first. And I guess I should put some fuel in there. Just use coal. It's going to town. Yes. First ores are starting to go. Uh, I guess I could take it off in a minute, but let's make some gold waterproof. And I'm gonna need two things of gold. Do it like this. It's not like a big deal. Just so I can speed this up quite a bit. Because it's going pretty and the sun is setting okay. <laughs> pretty happy with this. I'm to be honest, I have never really used um, geothermal power just because it was always such a hassle. Because um, back without the red power or the other mods that make the volcano go, you had to just go down into the bowels of the earth, basically, and do that, but that takes a lot of time, and, like, this was really simple, actually, just, you know, even in the nether, it'll be pretty easy. You know what you're doing, at least. There we go. Let's get some cactus. Oh, excuse me. But this cactus is always a pain to get. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, we got eight. Go run that up there. So it doesn't run out on me. Let's go! Now, the other machines I'm going to need to build are... Um, an extractor for now. Maybe another furnace, I'm not sure. Um, I don't think I'll be building a compressor just yet. Don't need it. Um, so do they have... They must. Yeah, mixed alloy, ing alloy ingots. But... Oh crap, it's... Oh no, I just slept. Um, but... Most likely in the next video, I'll maybe start trying to fool around with some red power, so I'll get some uh, alloy furnaces going. To be honest, I have never touched that. The only time I've actually done anything with that, which um, I put um, some lamps in a creative world <laughs> in Tekkit. But for some reason, every time I played Tekkit, um, yeah, I could play for about 15-20 minutes. And it would just start lagging like crazy. Like it would, you know, go right down to zero or one, and it would go back to fifth, like a hundred or whatever I'm at, and then right back down quickly. It was really weird. I don't know what it was. Like my computer's really good. I could run this on far distance, except I don't like lag at all. It really annoys me. Okay. do this. Let's do it so I don't pretty sure you don't have to power it. I just don't want to break um make lava flow out of it. This should speed it up. Let's watch it. Come on. Oh, it's so weird. Yeah, a little bit. I guess if you had the whole thing made of gold, you would see a bigger difference, but... Eh. 
Sorry, just unlocking my phone again. 20 minutes, eh? I can do more. And each video will be average about, I don't know, maybe 30 minutes. Not gonna do... Oh, oh, that was close. Anything crazy like... Oh, well, maybe in the future I'll do... Longer ones if you guys want. But I don't see any interest in doing a hour long video right now because there is no point really. Because not a lot of people watch it right now because I'm new. Okay, <laughs> but this is filling up nicely. Yeah, so let's go on. I'm going to try to. Geo, so I need a generator. Refined iron glass. So I need furnace machine block. So let's actually get the iron going on. It's enough copper for now. I'll smelt all the ores off camera. Like um, these shard looking things all have to be smelted. Some of this stuff I have no idea what, but Oh my neck. Um I'm gonna need some tin. Yeah, what do I have? No, I used it. And it goes. Four tin. Two, four, two, four. So that's gonna have to be macerated. Just start putting some in there. Just so it can go a little bit faster. I plan on building, like, there won't be just these two. There'll be a whole group of them. And I'll eventually have, it won't be just one generator. I'll have a couple, um, maybe four or five generators pumping into a MFE here. And the bigger one, I can never say it, MFUE or EU or whatever. I don't even know. I don't use it that much. But, right like, there's a lot of lava. Like, quite a bit of lava right there. This problem with lava is, unlike water, it keeps on, like, filling itself in, so you can... Like, that water could last me... Like, if I had an identical thing of lava like this, lava would run out way before this water would. Just the way the lava mechanics are, I guess. Okay... That should be enough. How many is that? Eh. Da. What is it again? I need a furnace machine block and copper cable. Five, six. Quite a bit of rubber, actually for now I guess but goes fast uh, redstone did it to a furnace there we go it's gonna get a new thing of there come on there I'll eventually get everything you know like all these, um, like the. I don't know if I can find them. Um. No idea where they would be. In here, maybe? I don't know, but in the future, I'll wanna. That's not how you spell it. There, I'm gonna want not advanced, but uh, see if I can find it. This bad boy assembly table takes four. Uh, this takes five diamonds. Just do that, but it gets powered by these lasers, which take two. Um, get the, you know, most of this stuff needs diamonds anyways so that's 
not going to do. I'll most likely have to make a pick. I'm likely going to make a pick out of that. So I can, um... So I can... Wait a minute. I'm going to need more tin than that, I'm pretty sure, because... That takes tin. Yep. That should be enough. Okay, let's make that battery. And once you play this long enough, you know, you remember the crafting um, stuff. Recipes, I guess. I'm just waiting on this. Oh, wait a minute. I guess this will do, yeah. Because I'm pretty sure it makes eight. I'm going to use the tin. It makes eight. Oh, 16. How was it? It was like this. I'm gonna need. Okay. Yeah, let's just do this so I know. Generator. There. Glass. Boom. Geothermal generator. Now. If I hook this up. I want to put it pretty close to the... actually I don't even have a bat box yet. I'll need to get one of those. But... How much time do we have left? Yeah, we got a little bit of time. How much is a bat box? Just need some more tin. Oh, nope. Tin and wood. How much wood? Just use this stuff. Okay, I got my cable. And I'm gonna need three of these it was, right? Yep. So I'm just looking at these other recipes here. Okay. Time to go to sleep. Also, um, see, yeah, bore. A tunnel bore. Um, that's part of the railcraft. In the, ooh, what are you doing in there? In the future, I think I'm gonna get, I'm gonna mine down and just let those go. I have a couple of them. They're not that expensive. I'll just let them go. Okay. That's not what I want. Bat box. I need one more and just enough. How are we doing? Oh yeah, I see I'm almost out of juice. Might as well make some wood pipes here, I guess. We're gonna need some. We're gonna need more waterproof pipes too. So we're gonna have to pump it out of those and into here. It's gonna have to be quite long because the copper cables run out, like they lose their um, power after so many blocks. I think it's five and then they run out. Uh, da, 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 boom. That box. Now, let's go around the back. Now, let's have it. I need a wrench, but I'm pretty sure you can just, yeah, change the direction with a wrench, but pretty sure that's the output, though. I think I'm doing this backwards. I always get this confused. With the amount I've played, I should know already, but. Okay. Pretty sure this is wrong. Yep. That's not. Oh, damn it. I need to make some bronze, but. Ah, shit. Should we risk it? 
Oh. Damn it. I gotta go fix that. There, now it's getting power. That is the output. So I'll fool around with that in the next video. But I'm pretty sure we're out of time here. Yep, uh, out of time. But basically, we have ores have been finished. That I can take off, I guess. That I have to finish yet and put that back up. But next time you'll see me, um, this will be all hooked up. I'll be charging with uh, geothermal. And I'll maybe take you guys mining, I guess. I don't know. There's not much. I guess I could go mining or fool around with the red power. But hope you guys like this. Um, let's play our, this episode. Please please leave a like. Um, go check out my tutorials. Just stretch in here. Just. Ugh, sorry. Just go check out my other videos if you want. Um, but yeah, hope you liked it. And see you in the next video. See ya.